Well, it's a, it stands for Classroom Performance System. And what it allows the students to do is, with the remote control, send answers directly to my laptop where quizzes have been set up, answer keys have been set up, and the responses uh, are instantaneous. I can sit up front and watch the responses as they're coming in. The computer, the grading is done by the computer. It's compiled into a grade book, and then I, uh, I can spend more time instead of grading, uh, mm -hmm. helping students that I can see who are struggling, uh, maybe not quite at the proficient level. I can, oh, go ahead. And it, go ahead, and it, and it uh, guides my instruction. It, it, helps, it helps me determine whether I need to go next and whether I need to spend more time on a subject or whether we are at that level where I can go on to the next topic. Mm -hmm. And how does it, how is it different for you as far as a teaching tool from a normal quiz where you they write down their answers and then you grade it. Well, it's mainly just the time constraints. You know, with a regular quiz, they turn in their quizzes. I have to sit down and grade them later in the day when I do have time, and then I get back to them 24 hours later how they're, you know, what the, what kind of uh, grades they got on it. And so now it's instantaneous. As soon as the quiz is shut off, I know the grades right then and there. I can post the grades. The kids can see how they're doing. Uh, it seems to create a lot more excitement too. Kids are real more, a lot more interested in seeing. How'd I do? How'd I do? How'd like I do? a game show? Yeah. And the other thing is you can uh, create some competitions, boys versus girls and stuff like that. Can you describe the pad for me here? Well, it's mainly just a remote control, and you're allowed to do numerical responses, letter responses. Uh, you can go back and forth on your answer key. And can they see whether they've got, a, whether they've got the right answer in that screen there? Nope. Now, what some students have done is when I'm watching the keyboard up front, they can mm -hmm. ask me, well, how did I do on the quiz? Mm -hmm. And if we have time, I can tell them, well, you got 8 out of 8 mm -hmm. or 7 out of 8, 6 out of 8. And then I never tell them which ones they got wrong. They can always go back and try to figure out which ones they got wrong. And then I give them a certain amount of time to take the quiz. And when mm -hmm. that time is up, it's over. And now, have you had this kind of resource your entire teaching career? No, I just started using it last year. And then this year's kind of taken off. And... It takes a little bit of time to, to create the quizzes the first time around, but once they're created, then I can just fine tune them from year to year. And uh, right now, I'm, I'm using it every day in all five classes.